Hi friends, today we will learn how to use the DHT11 and DHT22 sensor for measuring temperature and humidity with the Arduino board. These sensors are very popular for electronic hobbies because they are very cheap, accurate and they perform very well. Here are the main specification and differences between DHT11 and DHT22. The DHT22 is more expensive than DHT11. Its temperature measuring ranges from minus 40 to 125 degrees Celsius with 0.5 degree accuracy while DHT11 temperature ranges from 0 to 50 degrees Celsius with 2 degree accuracy. Also, the HD22 sensor have better humidity range from 0 to 100% with 2 to 5% accuracy, while the DHT11 humidity range is 20 to 80% with 5% accuracy. We can see this with these two comparisons that the DHT22 is better than DHT11. The sampling rate of DHT11 is 1 Hz means 1 reading every second while DHT22 has 0.5 Hz. And also, DHT11 have smaller body size. The operating voltage and maximum current are same in both the sensors. Now let's see how the sensor works. They consist of a humidity sensing component, NTC temperature sensor, that is thermocouple and IC on the back side of the sensor. For measuring humidity, they use humidity sensing component which uses two electrodes and moisture holding substrate between them. So as the humidity changes, the conductivity of the substrate changes or the resistance between the two electrodes changes. These changing resistance is measured by the IC and then read by the microcontroller. On the other hand, for measuring temperature, it uses NTC, temperature sensor or thermistor. The thermistor is variable resistance, the change in its resistance, the change in temperature. The term NTC means negative temperature coefficient, means the resistance decreases with increase in temperature. DHT11 and DHT22 both have four pins with the same configuration. First is VCC pin which takes 5 volts. Second is data pin which is connected to digital pin of Arduino. The third is not connected pin. And fourth is ground. Connect the DHT11 sensor and LCD to the Arduino board according to this schematic. You can download the schematic and the code from the official website. Here, the THT11 function will read the data from the sensor if you are using the HD22, then change it to the HD22. Upload the program, now it's done. If you have any queries, then kindly comment or ask. Please don't forget to like and share the video with your friends and don't forget to subscribe my channel. Bye friends, we will meet soon again.